One of the things I like to remind people about Color Lab is there is no undo. Instead, we use versions. Every time you change the show look, every time you make a reference, Color Lab saves another version. And in fact, I can go back and step through the variety of versions that are here. I'm going to take this shot. I'm going to hit the letter Z to reset it. And with it clean, I'm going to go ahead here and additionally remove the show look. I'm going to hit the plus button in the corner. That's going to create a new version. That's also the letter Y, as in yes, I want a new version. I'll have it do another auto color. You can see it shows up as a new version. I'm going to go to show looks. I'll try a couple different show looks here. When I find one I'm happy with, I'll have it make a new version. And you can see it's got whatever adjustments I've done to the shot along with the show look. This is how you handle trying to compare different ways of playing with your footage. Anytime you want, you can add a new version, subtract one you didn't like, or clear out all the versions. This is just metadata, meaning it takes up no space whatsoever as far as the project is concerned.